One, like I said earlier, celebrating sister birthday is not a joke. Coming, coming this far, 
the Lord has sustained her. And the Lord has given it, laid into her heart to give back to the society. This is wonderful. And this is what we appreciate for every well meaning individual in the society. Having this home here is kind of giving back to the society. We have so many children out there that are less privileged that do not have the opportunity to have formal education to be nurtured, to be useful to themselves and the society. And uh, Mommy Olubumi doing it here for them and for the society here today is well commended by the Nature of, uh, of Women Affairs and Development and by extension of the state government. Because this is what we do in Nature of Women Affairs to, be, to ensure that children all over the world are given adequate care. You know, she's a wonderful woman. She's a kind-hearted woman. You know, a, a, a woman with heart of God. You know, there is not, as the MC said before, yes. um, it would be a for people having money and they are worshipping money at the table. Once you have having a money, that you can have it for her to be given back to you know, the MC, you know, it's very, very important, especially, especially you know, that is why I actually came, because it was so charity, because it was giving motherless money, this home is about it's absolutely wonderful. I just pray that she continue to be, to make progress. Jesus, she to prosper. And God will continue to bless her so that she can continue to do the good work. All right, thank you very much, sir, for speaking with yes. us. When someone starts you, you can never stop. It's a, it's a joy that you cannot explain. Apart from the people being transformed, when you see the little amount and it's being productive. I can sleep very well. And I feel that I'm fulfilled now. We have to mend the, the panel. And you know, uh, I discovered that we don't need so much to be before they become somebody. I, I discovered it. And uh, I could see the children and the widows and the single mother. I cannot just stop doing that. But the more I do it, the more God gets me. And for example, when I wanted to start this work, I live by faith, and God just told me, go ahead and do it. And to the glory of God, you can see what is happening. It is not by mind or power, it's just, it is God that made it possible. And uh, I told my children, I am living because of the needies. There's nothing I'm living for. You are Shirin Duatayo, and I'm the son of the celebrant uh, Mr. Kulubunu Duatayo. Yeah, Pastor Mrs. Olu Pastor Mrs. Olubunu Duatayo, thanks. Nice meeting you in person. Sixth day birthday and opening of children's uh, home for the orphans here in Nigeria. Yeah. What is your take on this? How do you feel about this project? I'm very proud of my mother that um, that she has done this project because it's important also to help needy and uh, children in Nigeria. And she did her part and give part of her way in order to um, support children who are, who are father and motherless. Yes. yes. Okay, against that background, how can you define her personality right now? Her personality is, um, as a she's a very disciplined, wonderful person, and she's also kind of generous at the same time. Quickly, what is this? What is that significant thing you want to take out of this this entire project? Well, um, to this project, it's also good to inspire other people to do the same thing, also to think of needy people and help them as well, you not know, to, to be selfish. Okay, quickly, what is your message to Nigeria at this critical point in time in the history, in the country's history? Well, that's a good question. Um, well, actually, they just face a lot of challenging inflation, yes. um, tribal war, and um, religious war. It's very important that we are staying together as one nation to stay together and um, build up the nation and fight corruption yes. so that the following generation will also have a good example and um, also in Nigeria will prosper and so that all the professionals also come to Nigeria and use their skills instead of going outside and um, um, and working um, outside to improve another people's country and uh, see their skills in that way. Thank you very much for speaking to Echo Sati Channel on the Thank you so much. Welcome, yes. Thank you, sir. Yes. Uh, I can
I can sincerely appreciate his I mean, her efforts in making sure that uh, he, she affects lives. Hopefully, such a noble foundation like this, it is not an easy task. Yes. Yeah, we give glory to God for our life, for taking that extra effort to impart life, and as well to ensure that this foundation dished out to people around. I'm a guest of uh, Professor and Mrs. Achudo Gobea because I never knew Gome at all. But my impression, my very good impression of her today is uh, I feel very proud of her right. for the achievement and for what she has done. And uh, it's really doing the, it's now, a, it's, it's doing the job of a Christian. I want to be like her and then contribute to the development of uh, human beings. Then taking care of widow is, uh, is marvelous. And taking care of uh, orphans, uh, I congratulate her. On that. Make me come from Lagos to this uh, Akure. In fact, I don't even told my children that I'm going to Akure. They invite me to go because of the, uh, the houses on the earth. So I, I already called the her that I will make sure I will be happy. I was here since yesterday. And everybody, every, every one of us, happy about this process. We feed yours, give all what I want to, to eat. So I'm happy to say, well, well, my woman. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I wish her the best in life. I wish her children and her children, her children to be to be fought for the grace of God. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you very much. Someone that cares for everybody around. He doesn't love. He doesn't love. Uh, it's a good thing that she's celebrating this milestone. Uh, to her, uh, and the and I'm, I'm particularly glad to be part of the celebration. I came here in company of our group, a dialect of local language, where we have promoted the uh, speaking of the dialect and promoted the culture of the uh, For your information, I come to represent my friend, my dear old friend, Prince Michael Adini Adijida. He had wanted to come from Italy, but one is trying to fight him to continue to do this. I know you told me I should be here on behalf of him and the self by social club. That's why I'm here. I'm only a one that you know. They are not making a one in the car. I you to be here. I prefer the best of the human. Then I want a nominee if you see me. I want a nominee. So you know, you don't have to go in with him. You can take it. You can look at it.
Thank you.